Alright guys, it's uh, Anthony here from Powerhead Intensive uh, Bootcamp in here in Worthing. I hope you've enjoyed the uh, last few days of Christmas gluttony. Uh, I know I have. Uh, now, we're coming up to the new year and we all know what's going to happen in the new year. We're going to have uh, a, a bunch of people who are going to decide, okay, well now's the time, new year, new start, all of that stuff. Um, so what I want to do is help you try and avoid the biggest mistakes that everyone makes. Um, in January, 13 million people in this country, 13 million people in this country will all make the same resolution as you. They'll all come along, there's the big three basically, they stop smoking, make more money and get in shape. Now as I say, 13 million people will resolve to get in shape. Uh, by week three, 7 million will have quit. Yeah? Not great odds. Now, there's a really, really big reason for that, and that's because they get what they're doing wrong straight away. They go, okay, well, I need to lose weight, so therefore I need to exercise a lot more and probably clean up my diet a bit. And then they get the percentages wrong, for lack of a better term. Yeah? They start exercising a lot. You only have to look out of your window on New Year's Day and you'll see people running, just running, running and running. And that's what they do because they think, okay, well, the more exercise I do, the more weight I'll lose, which isn't entirely true. Um, and then, on the other hand, they completely half ass their diet. So they think, okay, well, I need to exercise a lot, get really enthusiastic, get out there in the freezing cold, start running, most people run because it's the it's it's something everyone can do, or most people can do at least every most able-bodied people. Um, and then they run a lot. They'll be out there most days. They'll run for long periods of time. They'll normally start uh, and do way too much, way too early. And then on the other hand, they'll just take a bit of a well, I need to eat a little bit less approach to their diet, or I need to eat a bit more healthy. Um, because of that. By week three, most people have got absolutely nowhere. Uh, and that's why, like I say, half of the people that have started would have given up by week three. Okay, now, if most people turned that on their head, they wouldn't give up. There'd be no problem. So the first thing you need to realize to avoid this mistake, to not be one of those people, is that what you eat is at the very least 80% of the battle, yeah? That's where you start. You need to exercise to look awesome, but you need to do the right type of exercise start, um, to begin with, but that's for, another, that's for another day. What you need to know right now is that you need to eat uh, the right stuff and get that right first, yeah? Make sure that you get on a effective um, eating plan first. The exercise that you do is there to accompany your eating plan, not the other way around. Okay? Get that right first. So, don't get out there on New Year's Day running and running and running. Yeah? Despite what Reebok tell you, belly is going to get you, but you know, it's more likely to get you because of what you put in your mouth, not how far you run. First of all, sit down, uh, get a little notebook if you have to and then work out what you need to do to your eating yeah, to uh, get to your goal. So write down how much you need to eat, uh, write down the type of food you want. Yeah, It will take you about half an hour and in that half an hour you can come up with a complete eating plan um, and not only that, by coming up with a complete eating plan you will have already written a shopping list. Problem solved. Take it down to Sainsbury's and you're good to go. Yeah? Um, get that right, then worry about the exercise. Okay? Because if you get the diet part wrong, it doesn't matter what you do when you exercise, you're going nowhere. Yeah? If you put the wrong petrol in your car, what happens? Yeah? You don't get somewhere slowly, you just don't get anywhere because your car will crap out on you and it'll have to be towed away and then sit in a garage for a couple of weeks. So don't be that person, yeah? Put the right fuel in your body, put the right amount of fuel in your body, then look into doing the right type of exercise, okay? And if you need help, 
that's what we're here for. There's tons of stuff on this blog. Yeah, we've got tons of recipes and God knows what. That, of course, my number. Um, that you can get hold of me. My number's at the top of the page there. All right. Um, yeah, this is Anthony from uh, PW Fitness, and I'll catch you next time.